Hey guys, welcome to another GTSS video. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the brand new heads up notification feature from Android L onto any Android device. So, the first thing you gotta do is obviously open up the Play Store. And uh, by the way, you don't need it to be rooted and it's completely free. So, search for heads up notifications in the Play Store and click on the more button that shows you more ones. And click on the heads up notification by Simon Codes. Uh, that's probably not his last name. Uh, there's not many downloads and it's a really small file, but go ahead and install it anyway. It'll only take a couple seconds, even if you're on a slow connection. Just go ahead and open it, and it's a really quick setup. Uh, all you have to do is tap that button and click the heads up for notification. This pretty much allows it to read all notifications, and that's the only permission it needs. So now you have it set up, I'm going to show you guys a couple of demos. So I, went, I logged onto my computer and signed into a different account and sent myself a chat message using Google Hangouts, and as you can see, in like three seconds, it pops up on the screen as a uh, floating notification. Uh, as you can see right there, I can open it and I can also dismiss it, just like I can in Android L. Uh, here I guess I'll show you guys another demo. I sent an email to myself, and it also works here. I can open, dismiss, similarly. So as you can see right there, um, I have it right there. So here I have a couple of images of just examples like emails and uh, stuff like that. It does uh, this. Note, this app is pretty useful. It pretty much does this with all apps, regardless of what you're doing. Um, it doesn't actually work for you know. It doesn't detect when you're in a game or anything. It just shows you heads up all notifications, and it works for all notifications. So as you can see here, I was uploading a drive picture. It still worked, um, and I think it's a pretty good app. Not many downloads. I don't know why. Um, it's a really nice app. You don't need to be rooted for it. It's not perfect. It's not official or anything, but it's the closest you're going to get for free uh, without rooting your device. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, you can click on that subscribe button if you want more videos, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.